Yo, what's good, YouTube? Today I'm going to show you how to win every game by putting on the right badges. So starting with finishing, you want to go Posterizer Max, Lithery Max, uh, Limitless Takeoff Max. Just put those as high as they can go. If you have extra, go Fast Twitch. That's me right there with the badges on. Now for the shooting badges, this depends on your build, but you're going to want to put Agent 3 as high as it can go. You're going to want to put Green Machine, Silver, Volume Shooter, Gold or Silver, whichever you want. And then Amped, uh, Gold or Hall of Fame if you can, but I have a Silver because that's as high as it goes. Guard Up on Bronze because that's what helps you make contested shots. Dead Eye on Silver if you can, but I have a Bronze. Limitless Range on Gold or as high as it can go if you can put that, uh, you can put a Hall of Fame. And then Blinders, I like that on Silver. But yeah, these are the shooting badges that you gotta put on that would like bro this will help you a contestant I'm telling you bro that's me right there with the shooting badges you know makes it a lot easier to shoot I even make some contested shots but I'm a center you know playmaking is very simple because it's only a few badges that really like will affect your game you wanna put quick first step high as that goes you need that hall of fame if you can but just put as high as it goes Handles for days, gold, mate, Hall of Fame if you can, go unpluckable gold, and go hyperdrive gold. Unpluckable, make sure the ball doesn't get rid from you, you know, especially when you're going against locked out and stuff. If you can't, put clamp breaker, bronze, or silver because that helps you get blow bys. But yeah, you need those badges and, you, and you'll be dribbling all right. I'm telling you, you'll be getting past lockdowns. Now this is me with the with the playmaking badges, but remember I only have a 70 ball handle and I barely have any playmaking badges because you know I'm a I'm a seven foot center so it's hard, but I still got a demigod. Now for defense, I'm gonna hook y'all boys up because I really know about defense. So for anchor, you're gonna want to put that on bronze if you're a guard. That's very important because that's all you need. You only need it on bronze. But if you're on center, put it as high as it goes. I would go gold or hall of fame if you can. Then go silver interceptor if you can, or go bronze if that's what you have. But you know, silver is really good, it helps you get them steals. Go work, you can go bronze workhorse, that's underrated because it like you can see a difference, but only if you have extra. If you don't, then don't put it. Ankle braces, bronze to not get broken. Chase down artist, silver if you're a guard, hall of fame if you're a center. Glove on silver or gold if you can, and rebound chaser on bronze for guards and max for center. That's me getting snatch blocks with the badges. This post score has post scoring take, but you know, I got the right badges on. Now, this is me guarding a guard. I got a chase down artist. I take it back out and splash. Alright, like and subscribe if I put y'all on. Y'all gonna be doing better.